This morning, following all the drama of yesterday, Suella Braverman steals the headline. Suella Braverman was the uh, Home Secretary who stood at the dispatch box and screamed, Invader! Invader! About Albanians and then about Pakistanis. And uh, she received complaints from Crown Prince Lekka in Albania and from the Albanian Prime Minister, Edi Rama, and she was defiant. There was no, there was no um, apology. And uh, so this morning she has, she has gone into the news. Uh, there's not very much information about it, except that she has called to unite the right and link up with Farage. So although four members of the uh, Conservative Party have already taken £5,000 from Lawrence Fox. Now, a senior member of the uh, former, a senior former cabinet minister uh, has called out with a statement of disloyalty in the Conservative Party and in Sunak, it is an astonishing display at a time when I suppose unity might be expected and might be required, but all forms of um, expected behaviour, I think, are off at the moment and anything could happen. These have been a series of rotten days for Rishi and... He has, he has behaved badly and without thought. He's been advised appallingly by Isaac Levido and his friends Forsyth and uh, the, the little cabinet uh, of spads that he's collected in Number 10, who have advised him to go for this election at this time, and who clearly are incapable of giving him uh, seriously useful information and directing his campaign and his party in the right way uh, to ensure survival of the Conservative brand after the next election, quite apart from uh, winning the next election. This is now about the... Uh, future of the Conservative Party as a concept. And it's also about the structure of the House of Commons after the next general, after the general election is over. It's about whether or not there will be a decent opposition and, and how that will look. Because a good government is only as good as its opposition in an adversarial format that we've got in the UK. And at the moment, it looks as if the opposition is going to be completely wiped out uh, in a sort of Canadian style. This is what people are talking about, the Canadian style wipe out of the Conservative Party. The Canadian Conservative Party uh, was wiped out a few years ago now um, and went from a party of the majority to a party of two and pundits are predicting the Conservative Party in the UK is going to go the same way the oldest party. And that is astonishing. And perhaps as astonishing is Braverman's pitch in favour of Farage. She couldn't do much worse than if she publicly voted for reform, could she? Uh, this is a, a, you know, in normal circumstances, she would be thrown out of the party. I don't think the party can afford to lose anyone. I would throw her out.